hey loves um it's erica welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new hi my name is erica and if you're not new welcome back welcome back so today's video will be about uh i'm doing a q a would be have you ever cried at a film now it's been some films that i have cried at because what thing about me baby if i'm watching a movie and it's real sad or anything oh baby i ain't gonna i'm gonna cry i'm gonna cry because i'm not a, i'm not afraid to say that i'm gonna cry i'm gonna cry like what's the movie um, Lion King. Boy, it was open. You, if you watch Lion King, you know what I'm talking about. Scar pushed Mufasa off that cliff, boy. And he fell and those buffaloes was running after him. Boy, I almost went off. Like, I thought I was in the movie. <laughs> like, I was about to go off. Because, like... And plus his son was standing there, but that would make me cry. Cause seeing like seeing I couldn't imagine like him just seeing his father just down there dead, bruh. Like seeing what happened to him, that would have hurt me. That would have hurt me. <sighs> Anyways. Second question is my favorite holiday. My favorite holiday. Well, I'm gonna be honest, I really don't have a favorite holiday, but one that I actually love the most will be Thanksgiving. Cause I get to eat. I'm not I'm not fat anything, but I get to eat. And my grandma, she used to cook her up here. Where she at? Up. Her up there. Yeah. She used to throw down boy. My so my whole family can cook too, so you already know it'd be smack. No, I'ma eat. I used to love Christmas when I was little, but I really don't like it right now. I don't like it now. Third question is, what is your biggest pet peeve? Y'all, my biggest pet peeve, I got three. Three. The first one, don't tap me. I hate when people tap me, bro. Like, it irritates me so bad. Like, ooh, like, why are you tapping me? Don't tap me. Second, I hate when people be loud early in the morning. You know, if you ride a bus or anything, you always have that one person or that one group of people that likes to be loud. Like, it's 7 o'clock in the morning. Why are you loud? Like, please be, please, please let me know something because you woke up and decided to be loud. Please be, please, come on now. Come on, we gotta do better. We gotta do better. Anyways, fourth question is, do you have a hidden talent? So, my main talent is dancing. Um, But I, ha I do have a hidden talent. I can draw a little bit. And I can do hair. But I don't really tell people I can do hair because I do my own hair. I'm still practicing at it. I'm not going to say I'm that good at it. But... I, you know, you know, if I, if I had to do it, you know, I'll do, it, you know, you feel me? So, yeah, that's really just my hidden talent. I can draw a little bit, not that much. And like I said, I dance. As y'all, if y'all can't see up there, that's my color guard stuff. I do color guard for Southwest Edgemont High School. Yeah, that's my last year, so I'm um, kind of. Not glad that it's, it's going to be over, but then I'm kind of glad. But anyway, that's my point. Next question, what motivates you to work hard? For one, the top thing that motivates me to work hard is God. Because before I do anything, before I make these YouTube videos, any decision I make in my life, I pray about it. Like, before I do anything, I pray about it. 
like and that gives me the strength and the courage to go ahead and you know mot it motivates me to do what i need to do <sighs> sixth question um what is my biggest fear y'all my biggest fear is spiders i don't care i don't care i have two biggest fears the second one y'all gonna laugh at but The first one is spiders, dog. I am scared of spiders. I don't care how big, tiny, tall, small, long, short, medium size. I don't care. If I see a spider, I am losing my mind. Do you hear me? I am losing my mind. I don't care. I, I'm going to lose my mind. Second one, y'all going to laugh at me. Y'all know the little inflatable things that be at car sales? Like the things that be the, these up here, yo. I am scared of them. So back then, a little story time. Oh, uh, I was like little, and one had deflated over me, but I was so scared. Ever since then, I can't look at them. I don't want to be around them. Like I'm just scared of them. Next question: If you could live anywhere, where would it be? Probably Atlanta, because, probably Atlanta, because I feel like that's a new experience, and there's so much stuff down there that you could actually do, but not in the bad part of Atlanta, like, either Atlanta or Charlotte, I think, either way, it's going to be somewhere out of North Carolina, because... Yeah, I like to travel and explore different things. Yeah. Next question is, what's your favorite place you'll travel to? Atlanta. Again, I have traveled to Atlanta, and it was it was so fun. Like, and no, and another place was Murder Beach. Like, mind y'all, I never been to South Carolina. I went to Murder Beach this year, and it was so fun. Like. Y'all, let me tell y'all, we had got on these rides. I ain't never been on the drop zone or anything like that. And mind you, I'm 4'11". I'm not scared of heights. I love me some heights. Now, that's one thing about me. I love me some heights. I got on that drop zone. Boy, when I tell you. I was on my sleep under my window. But when I tell y'all, we went up. I was perfectly fine. When we went down, I felt like my heart went to the bottom of my ass, dog. Like, yo, I was so scared. Like, when I tell you, after I left, I was still thinking about it. Like, it traumatized me. That, oh my God, that ride traumatized me so bad. Oh my God. Never again. It's not a, not a 10 out of 10 rule recommend. No, it was like a, a slight 4.10. 4. I was scared. Like, no, I was like, when I tell you, when I got off the ride, I was shaking. Like, I was shaking. It was bad. <sighs> Next question, what is my favorite music? Okay, now, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. My favorite music is R&B. Because ain't nothing... Like sitting in your room, vibing, you know, doing what you do, and listen to some old R and B music. Like, yeah, I'm a very old soul, so I like listening to R and B music. I don't really listen to hip hop like that, but when I do, I listen to it a little bit, but not a lot. But I really love R and B music. This question is. What is your biggest goal for your YouTube channel? My biggest goal for my YouTube channel is to, like, the stuff that I be doing on YouTube, that I will be doing on YouTube, it will be more about, like, self-care, little talks, motivation talks, vlogs, fun, just a whole bunch of vibes, like, and I really want my YouTube channel to inspire people, like. Don't be scared to do YouTube. Because, honestly, it took me a while. I've been wanting to do a YouTube channel. 
I was just scared. Like, I was afraid. Like, I didn't know. I ain't believe in myself. Now that I got the courage to, I really want my YouTube channel to be an inspiration to somebody. To, like, just believe. Like, oh, I can do this. Are you, girl? You better get up. And you ain't got no camera. You better use your phone. You better clear out some storage. Because these YouTube videos take up storage. You better clean out your storage. And you better start recording. It ain't never too late, Buki. It's never too late. I promise you. You better get on that. So the last question I have today is, are you ready for school? I'm going to be honest with y'all. Yeah, I am. I ain't going to lie. I am ready for school. Because um, I feel like this year is going to be a really good year. Because this is my last year. Like I, I told y'all in my first video that I made. Yeah, this is, this is going to be my last year. Um, I'm a senior. And I have a lot of stuff planned for um my senior year and everything. So, yeah, you know, I took my senior pictures and all of that other stuff. So, yeah, I get a lot of recognition this year. I mean, I like recognition, but not that much. But my principal, she don't play about recognition. If you go to Southwest and you watch my channel, you would know, like, she do not play about that senior recognition. She's going to get the seniors to do everything in their power. I'm talking about everything. Like, even stuff you don't even plan on doing. It's, it's a lot. But, yeah, um, that would be, this would be the end of the video. Um, It wasn't that long because I didn't have that many questions. But I will be making more videos and stuff for my YouTube channel. Just keep looking out, you know. I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Because I will be coming with more videos and more bangers for one. Because I definitely will be doing more vlogs. I'll be doing challenges. I'll be doing get ready with me. Just a whole bunch of vibes. Because... I'm just, I'm just that person, like, I like good vibes, like, I'm a vibe my whole self, even most people that do YouTube, most people you'll ask, like, oh, how's Eric, yeah, she's a whole vibe, like, I'm not a born person, I can be sometimes, but when you really around me, and I'm really comfortable around you, like, I'm really a vibe, like, <laughs> anyways, um, I hope you enjoyed this video, like I said, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, have that notification bell on so you can be notified every time I post a video. And yeah, I will see y'all in the next video. Oh, by the way, the next video will be getting ready with me for my last day. Because I'll be doing a, um, a get ready before my last day and everything. But I'm not going to say too much about that. Y'all will just see when the video comes. So, okay. Bye, loves. Mwah.